I first got involved with SWE my freshman year. I was just like a general member. And then um, I was a part of the mentor mentee program. And my mentor, um, she suggested that I go to the BCD planning committee, which is like the, it's basically like a group of people that plan um, this really big outreach event called Bourne's College of Engineering Day. And so I joined that um, and it was like so much fun. It was a really great introduction to SWE and like a way for me to get more involved with the club. Um, and then I got like a little more involved becoming an officer. Um, but I feel like SWE has really helped me um, because it kind of gave me like a really safe space to like feel welcome as a woman in engineering because um, like coming into engineering I felt like really insecure um, with my choice for ME and I really wasn't encouraged to go into engineering um, growing up and I really like appreciated SWE for being like a very encouraging space and it's also given me a good platform to like help advocate for women um, in STEM um, through like outreach and all the events that we do. Um, so I'm really grateful to like be a part of this organization. Yeah, so um, I started coming to SWE meetings probably the end of my second year, I think. Um, but I, I just came occasionally. It wasn't really like like a commitment or anything like that but um at the beginning of last year actually my third year I decided that I wanted to start like actually being a part of it um and so I started coming and <clears throat> I just really enjoyed like like Catherine was talking about just having that space to be around engineers who are female and having that like experience was really nice because I didn't have anything like that before mainly because I was an athlete and I just didn't have very much time but um now like I think it, it benefits me in a way where I'm able to come out of my shell a lot more because in the past like I've been kind of reserved and um being in that like environment has helped me interact better and like want to interact with all these different like majors and all these different people and I love it um and that actually was what encouraged and motivated me to run for academic development co-chair. So now I'm like really a part of it. And I just, I just really enjoy all of that. So it's been a great experience. Oh, so I joined SWE a little over a year. Um, I was a general member, but I never thought I was gonna like run for everything, anything. So I met Vanessa was the first person I met, which was the current president. And she was like, she was also a chemi. So she was like asking me about classes. She was helping me. And it was just like a very welcoming experience, like for my first general meeting. And then she was like encouraging me to run, but I wasn't sure because I was like kind of nervous about it. Like if I was really going to go into like this org and I ended up running and I was um, co-social um, chair. And I really enjoyed planning events and things like that. And I enjoyed being like, around people that are my major and they know the struggle because like we all struggle and it's fine like it's okay at first I was like trying to hide my struggle like no I'm good but like then you get to see that everybody else is like sometimes not okay and it just like kind of like makes you feel like relaxed like okay we're on the same boat like we got each other and things like that so yeah yeah so I got involved with SWE in the middle of my third year so I've only been in it for probably six, seven months, so sort of short, but um, I was really brought in by like the warm atmosphere. So I was part of another engineering club, but it's sort of more like, I don't want to say cold, but it's not as intimate or like warm as sweet. So uh, I guess it just helped me with public speaking, with event organization, and also with um, keeping me informed on what opportunities are out there not only for bioengineering, but also for other majors. So if I have friends in other engineering fields, um, I can also be like, hey, there's this opportunity, you know, for this um, engineering major. Um, but I just really like the environment for sure. It's, I feel like it definitely helps you just stay motivated. And then, I don't know, but I just really want to 
sort of tackle the problem of women in the workforce sort of leaving due to like poor environments. I know a lot of women do end up getting engineering jobs, but they don't end up staying. So I really hope that being part of this club will encourage women to really stick to it and create an environment where more women feel welcome to continue their career. Yeah, um, so <laughs> I joined SWAY my freshman year of college. Um, I, <laughs> I was dragged in by my roommate because she actually uh, knew SWAY because she had a chapter back at her place. And so we went out to the general meetings, but I think it wasn't until like actually attending the smaller committee meetings. So like task committee or like the BCD committee meetings um, where I actually felt like this, this was actually like a comfortable place to like get involved and like feel like you're doing something other than school. I feel like having that like aspect of college life is really like, it's a necessity because then you're not like, overwhelmed with school and like having school being the like the entire universe yeah like yeah you're a student I get like we get it we all get it because we're all students um and like being like a good student is like one of the main priorities but I feel like there are certain moments where just being a student isn't healthy because say like what happens if you like do bad on a test then you're like oh then that like then that like kind of defines who I am but like getting involved with other stuff and like um meeting new people it like creates a safe space um to make you feel like okay like it's not just a student that defines me it's it's more than that like I can do more than that I am more than that basically and so we really emphasize that so he also taught me like a lot of like soft skills um, so like presentations, I've gotten, I've gotten to do a lot of presentations and I feel like with experience you get, you gain, you get better at it <laughs> over time, um, time management, uh, <laughs> because you have to plan events all the time. Um, but other than that, I like, I really enjoy SWE and like SWE means a lot to me because of how much time and effort I put into it. But then again, like with everything, it's how much time and effort you put into everything that like kind of makes up like what it means to you in your life. But yeah, that's my experience with me. <laughs>